Take it, pull me towards him! Hello, fellow cultists, and welcome back to Biomutant. Now, you may have noticed that in the last episode, everything kind of cut off without an outro. That is because not only did my <laughs> recording software crash again, because I'm still recording on the crap top, which Calypso will put a photo up of the crap top here shortly. Um, this is Calamity's current recording setup. She's hoping to upgrade to a desktop next year. I'm also streaming my Xbox to my laptop and the audio kept cutting out. So there's that too. Anyways, when we last left off, we were trying to find a vault. I just threw my controller around the, across the room, so I gotta go get that now. If it ain't one thing, it's another. Just a minute. All right, so now that I no longer have a case of the dropsies. I can get back to doing what I need to do. <laughs> oh jeez. So we're currently hiding out in a bathroom. I'm hearing a bajillion and one noises around me. I don't think you could make a home here. Yeah, well, maybe I can, maybe I can't. Who knows? <coughs> Oh, hello. So I was hearing noises. Nope, get back up there. Ugh, climb up, stop trying to climb down. Oh, I guess it doesn't matter. So, where is our... It might be outside. And when we last left off, we were also being attacked by the turnip people. So, where there was that, too. Can't open that door back there. All right, well, let's go find where this thing. Ooh, what the hell? Who's attacking me? Is it turn up people again? I don't know. So this is the way that I need to go. Down that way. Oh hi, Hootie. Rubber scrap is too much fun. So stretchy. <clears throat> this is no time for sleep. I wasn't trying to sleep. I have found a vault. I'm assuming this is another underground bunker. Stick in the key. Mr. Shison. Looks valuable. What's this? Sparktron Hypertiscrompa. Well, I can pick up. 
another cap. Should I just scrap? Scrap the cap. Scrap cap. It's still not the banana blade. Is that literally all that was here? That was kind of a waste of time. Alright. Me. Alright, so. Moving on. I'm gonna finish exploring this town. What? What was that? have to make your own path. What am I hearing? I'm hearing like loud thumping. But I'm not seeing anybody. I don't know. There's no epic music going off, so I'm assuming that I'm fine. Oh, I am definitely not fine! Whale sheet! So that's done. Alright, so which house did I go into that had the thing that I couldn't get down to? Oh, to believe how serious this is if you want to have any effect on it. I don't know what you're talking about. in here. Ooh. Okay, and now there's a Not thing. every day you see a seems like the controls need some organizing to set the mechanism in motion. There we go. Let's watch this video. Excellent. That's illuminating. I don't know what that was for, but it's obviously for something. I don't understand their she. I don't understand that shit yet. All it, all it sounds like is he's saying something about bedwetting. Alright, I think this is the house with the downstairs climb. Ah! Fork! Could be easy to get lost down here. Good. 
friend wind. All right. Guess you still want more than that. They had a big guy down here. that way what goes where does this go oh that's cute i'm gonna save that i'm gonna upgrade that so i can wear it nothing in this bathroom so let's go up the stairs let's see where this goes keep your guard up i don't like when you say that Playing the playground. I'm gonna slide down the slide. Come on, let me slide down the slide. You can never have too much scrap, plastic or otherwise. Alrighty. Let's go ahead and level up. There's this house over here I don't think I've checked out yet. In fact, I know I haven't checked it out yet. Mainly because there's trousers in the thing. Biohazard box. That oh, muscles. Go grab the bar and start squeezing those muscles. Let's go. I don't like the fact that they're changing you the freaking thing. You snapped that off? Feeling pumped up. Did I actually break it? No. Okay, well, that was fun. So, there's an old world gadget around here somewhere. So many places to be today. Turn up, people! All right, the turn up people are dead. I've smurdered them. They've been smurdered. Yum. Where is he? He's carrying a toilet. Oh, that is not a flattering facial expression for you, bud. Alright, well. 
back to work. There we go. Alright, let's go check out this house. Is there anything in here? Nope, can't even get down to the basement. So many leaves on so many things. Yes, well. I do like how I have unlimited ammo. That is like... Not. All games should be like that. Like, I hate when you're fighting in a game like this and all of a sudden you run out of ammo and you're like, oh, what am I gonna do? Calamity missed this flush stool here, because the quest here didn't mark it for her. Hopefully she comes back to it later. Like, I don't want to leave this area until I've scrounged about enough, but, um... We need to go back to him. I'll fast travel back to him. Because we can. Yeah, you may notice that the camera's not shaking as much as it was. That is because I finally put a coaster underneath the leg of the table that I used to hold my laptop up. Calamity's simple fix with a hocus pocus coaster. Um, so it's not wobbling anymore. Alright, so we're back for the Moog. Moog. That shit's bigger than you! How was I carrying that around? Fluff dung before, and always wondered what they'd unlock. Discover the rest and you'll find more keys. There's plenty of poo to go around. Moog says you did good on that last monster. He hopes you have time to help him seek out I've the got monster. plenty of time. Should I want to fight here. monsters. It's not too far away. It shouldn't take you as long as the previous one. Ja. But that's no reason to waste time. Kalibar. If you keep at the haunt, you'll round them all up in no time. There's a bright day coming! Hey, that's going to get you burned. The only one getting burned around here is you. That stinks. Oh, do you want some best tea for that? Moog appreciates your company. Wouldn't be surprised if you met. Okay, so where is the Sparky Twigson? He said it's not too far from him. Not too far from here. Okay, so that's what he considers not too far, huh? Are you scared yet? It's getting dark. I stopped being afraid of the dark when I was 12. It's not the dark that I'm afraid of, it's what's in the dark that I'm afraid of. Like this thing that will haunt us for the rest of our days. Calypso. It's a proper junk depot. Just think of the things chucked away. Alright, 
we're going on a little side track here because apparently this is a junk depot. Mm -hmm. Wah! Holy crap, he can pull me towards him! some matrix shit. Ow, don't step on me. Rude. Why is there an ice demon? Please tell me that ice demon's on my side. Nope, I say not. He's definitely not on my side. Is, but it's terrifying. That looks like a pumpkin. Alright, now that that fun's out of the way. Let's just look around for what we came here for in the first place. Take your time and enjoy the daylight. Does the narrator have to talk every three seconds? All right. Another jacket. Apparently there's a biological container around here somewhere. Yep, there it is. And then this thing. Alright, well, the area is completed. Let's just grab this other first aid and head on out. Alright, back to what we were doing. After we got distracted. Oh good, it's saving. Turn up, people! Are dead. My agility needs to be 50 and my level needs to be 18 before I can use my electric type weapon. Okay then. Such a soggy day. There should be a veggie around here for that thing. You can make so many amazing things out of oh, this scrap. Beastie? Mm. This is my mount. <laughs> we still need to come up with a name for him. If you guys have an idea for a name for this little cutie, let me know in the comments below because we really need to name him. Creeper. I mean, look at how cute he is. No, look at the camera. He does it. He's shy. He doesn't want to look at the camera. 
Oh, he's adorable. Oh, there's some plastic plants up ahead. Yes, plastic. Here you got Bo's teak hanging in that little blimp. Has an upgrade bench too. Hello. Claims to have strange things from the depths and flinken from Says they're known for their high quality goods. Never know what you might find. The miscellaneous. I don't know what these are for. I'm guessing they're collectibles. I also have poo still in my inventory. I have poo in my inventory. Alright, let's go up here and check out the upgrade bench. I want to try to get some upgrades done. This could be the beginning of the end of everything. Alright. Go back to what we were doing, which is why do these look like cows from Dr. Seuss? I mean, they're adorable, don't get me wrong, but they do, they remind me of cows from Dr. Seuss. And I don't see a berry thing anywhere. Where was that? It's a rare sight. Treasure it. Wildlife here is teetering on the brink of extinction. That's a we rare all sight. Are. The meat eater again. Nothing seems to satiate his hunger. The note is done for unless you intervene. I get demon goat? Are you telling me I get to ride the demon goat? I have the demon goat! Look at this majestic fish! I have a demon goat now! Is there? here for a reason. It's up to you to figure out what that is. I don't know what that is, but that's a mess of some sort. Health pack. Is there anything else around here? Apart from those adorable little things. Alright. Back to goat. Our majestic friend. survive here? Nah. Yeah, it's too cold. How do I survive the chill? It's a cold zone. Even a thick coat of fur is enough to keep you warm here. Smell that. It's the Glurp paddock. Chubza must be nearby.
He's a gator. Of sorts. Gator rat. Rat gator. He's heard what's happened to you and wouldn't have blamed you a bit if you'd given up and gone on back home. He'd have done that long ago. Baba Zulu. Says it's probably best if you can't. Means those like him can still get away with it, though. What's up? He's impressed by the courage needed to get you to this point. He knows that he'd have strayed from the path long ago. Under threat or not, the thought of home is just too appealing to him. He hopes that you'll find a way to save the Tree of Life, and along with it, the world, and all the homes in it, including his. If your home means anything to you, well, he doesn't care. He just wants you to think about those like him who can't do much to save theirs. Sometimes he wonders what life would be like if he lived somewhere else. Different home says you might not say that if you had a home, but you came here instead, right? Zaduna. Surprised the world's going to survive. Guesses he can keep his huh. home now. Oh, Believes you tried Michael your Jackson. best to make things better, and not just for yourself. Ooh. Heard the myriad welcomed you into their home. It's so bright and amazed about that. Seems like it might be too well, at least unconsistent the narrators are to translator. call home. Intabadam Wadzufa. The homes of others don't really matter that much, though. Winsila Goyo. He says whatever you think. Big isn't better. It's just bigger. What you see here isn't what you get. There's more going on than meets the eye. Unless you're gonna help me get into the cold zone. His name I don't is Chapsa. A name doesn't mean much, maybe, but you should know he's built his foundation on something larger than himself. La fea now, with the world on the brink of destruction and all, the time has come for him to find a new home that's better suited to his... Figures the world ending might make it pointless, but if it doesn't end, he wants to be in a better place. Chubsa says there's no place like home. Even though I've he's got like on it, four minutes in mind, left on heart, my and body, timer, and I'm going to spend the last four minutes the talking to this to be. gator If you truly rat. get in touch with something from the scorched earth, like a carrot, you get in touch with the land in such a way you feel in touch with true life. Once he gets going, you'll Excuse understand. Chubsa wonders if you've seen any carrots in the ground nearby. He's been needing one for a lemma. Figures you're the right looker for the job. <sighs> well. I guess we're off to find a carrot for this dude. <laughs> Still, these things look like There are no. places up ahead far worse than this. Well, I can't go into the frozen zone yet because I don't have what I need for it. Maybe he's going to teach me how this carrot magically shoved up my butt is going to keep me warm. I don't know. By the gods, why is your brain <coughs> always in the gutter? Beastie can't hear a damn thing I'm saying, so... <laughs> no comment from the peanut gallery. <laughs> What That's in the ranch, name of feet? An entire farm poisoned by toxinol rads. Don't stay there long. So we're gonna save before going in there because something tells me I might die. We need to find the carrot that he's looking for. Apparently he's over here somewhere. This is a radioactive zone. 
It's not healthy to go too far in without protection. What's the... Where am I going for that? So that we can go get that in the next episode. Because I am out of time. So... Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed it, please leave a like. Uh, let me know down in the comments below what we should name our new demon goat. And also our flat-faced friend. And until then, stay safe, stay healthy, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!